Today's Captain's Blog is brought to you by Frank Lawler, who holds the Guinness World Record for the number of consecutive days somebody has sent me a random link. Hi there guys, welcome to today's Captain's Blog. It's 12.17 hours on Thursday, December 22nd, 2016, and Moose did a thing. You ready to show him? Yes. The fill screws up the C's. I just learned that uh, bigger numbers mean a tighter fill and smaller numbers mean a looser fill. Oh, okay. We're just going to ignore the eye in science. Apparently. She's freaking me out. Eyes are beneath it. I, I also learned that it uh, requires me to hit apply to the design. I'm not making what I thought we were doing. That's okay. We're, just... okay. we're learning. <laughs> You ought to see it when it's doing things like this with steel. Oh yeah, this is going to be, I, I can see the opener for a CNC training being done on this. This is also a great, easy way to explain what the uh, overstep is when yeah. you're trying to program something. That was cool. Yeah.
the fuck are you doing? <laughs> what? What the fuck is this? I think I had a stroke or something. It's trying. I, I need to learn about the fill. <laughs> We needed that, yeah. <laughs> I'm a <up> robot. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely cuts into its holes. So can we run like master cam on this? Uh, no. Because that'd be kind of cool. It runs off of an Arduino. <laughs> oh. Okay. We can teach you you could technically do, you know, like, it'd be fun to do layout drawings. You could probably do put your piece of metal down, have a draw of your layout. I don't know how accurate it'd be. But... I, have, I have a desire to have one of these that'll do like a 4x8 sheet. I was reading about how you can modify for purposes like that. Oh, there's hey, the yeah. Iron Man! Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? What? Oh, uh, what is this? Stop it. That was what? what we were trying to cut. What? <laughs> the shit? <laughs> Alright, so let me get this straight. I could be wrong. But some dude is selling pretty much the guts of a pen plotter for 400 bucks. I could be wrong, this is cool, but I kind of want to get a really big pen plotter and take it apart. Oh, you done, you done fucked it. It's not happy. I thought it went to home. <laughs> that wasn't home. This is not your home. This is not your beautiful house. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do well, it. to return it to home, you have to do it manually. Because, really? you know. No, so I returned smart. it to home earlier. G54. New, new machine. So the Axi Draw arrived, and it works, and it's smarter than us. Um, and it does this. And we'll have to figure out its we're learning. delicate. And we're learning. We're actively learning. Agile education. It is agile education. This is recreational education. Uh, that's awesome. That did come out pretty cool. It did. I mean, did had a little moment of possibly a stroke or something, <laughs> but it was doing all right. I think if we doubled the fill on that, that would be pretty impressive. That's cool. And if we mentioned that it That's even more fun than what I did right before I came down here. What? Well, Dr. Amy is making chromosome cookies. Okay. I sent her a message saying, can I have an extra one? I'm feeling a little down. <laughs> I'm going to hell for that. <laughs> just that? Oh, well, there's a long list, but yeah. We'll be back. Hi there, guys. Welcome to Viewer Mail at the Geek. Today it's Thursday, December 22nd, 1408. Today's Viewer Mail is brought to you entirely by Denichi. That's what they tell me. You're they. Them. Those. You can call me they. It's okay. Save the packing. This is Amazon, so we can return it if it doesn't work out. What is it? It's a box. All that to ship this. What is it? What does it do? Amazon really likes using paper. Well, they are like so. This is true. Oh, it's there. oh, oh, I know what this is for. Thank you. This 
is the next part of the audio system for the high voltage lab. This is the extra receiver, or this is the receiver that's for the transmitter now. So this is for uh, high voltage lab audio for that part of the tour and the show. Thank you, sir. There was more? Oh, oh people were asking, the sign's back here. They took it down from up there, but we can put it back up. We just take this, it down and fell. This needs to go to the high voltage line. Maybe I'll do that with that end. I'll bet this is another one of those, or at least just the receiver. That's the receiver. You yeah, that's just the receiver, so this, this would probably be the one there. Okay. Save the pen. Exactly the same. In the same size of the box. So maybe the transmit. I think the power supply for that's in there. I'm guessing the third box from the. Boxes the same. Okay. I'm guessing the third box, this one here, is the transmit. We had back in the KZU era our first wireless setup. And we used it until it wore out. And we haven't had one since. Save the packet. Yeah, I, I got it the first few times. Okay. So this has head worn microphone. I don't know what this is. We could put all four of those boxes in the first box. They could have they yeah. could have done that. We don't know that they came from the same place. Oh, this is the body pack. Uh, comes with proper batteries, and, uh, and this will be the actual microphone. Oh, that's nice. This is this is pro audio stuff. So I'll get to play with this today, and uh, we'll get some blog on this. So you get to see all this happening in the blog. Not you guys. You guys will get to watch it live. I'll be in the high voltage lab after lunch. And uh, we'll set up some wireless audio mojo in the high voltage lab and in the lobby. For those of you curious following at home, we will be on the 512 to 542 megahertz band. And uh, the, micro the trend of receivers are the BLX4-H9. Now you know. Thank you, Danichi. We're going to get to work on this right after lunch, and it'll give me something to do while half the staff is not here today because of Christmas. Thank you, sir. You guys had fun. That's your mail for the day. We'll be back after this. Time is 15.58, and we have sure legendary performance. And we have to save the packaging. That's a really big deal with Danichi. I don't think we need to. It's a wireless mic and it's going to be fine. So this is our receiver. This will be the power supply for it. It's so cute! Are you seeing this? Shoom. What is in my pack? Oh! my mints. There's a magnet. It doesn't bother me that there's a magnet there. What bothers me is that the magnets stick to our stainless table. Our stainless table is a pretty shitty grade of stainless if a magnet will stick to it. I'm just leaving the sticker on there. Okay, so standard XLR, nothing special. power brick that we can even screw in place. And this oh, goes in there like this. 
where we're supposed to pull the thing through, like that, and then plug it in. And that's how you keep from unplugging it during live shows and important events and stuff. There's no antenna or anything because the antenna is probably way up. Yeah, this is 512 to 542 megahertz. There's no external antenna that's inside. It's probably all digital now. And we got to find an XLR cable. So we need a cable that looks like that and female. So that plug that we can plug into itself. And it only needs to be like three feet long because we got to get down to the mixer here. And we can just set this inside anywhere. It doesn't need, it doesn't need a lot. So we'll find a place to stick it on here. And we'll run it into one of the channels here. Okay? We'll make that work. We're going to find a cable and we'll be back. We're back with all new XLR. So we plug this into there. See? Mic out. Oh. And now we plug this into the mixing console. We're going to do this the easy way. Plug in a mic, plug in power, find a spot to stick the box. So mic will want track five. Five. Click. Is that five? One, two, three, four, five. That's five. Alright. So we'll set five all the way down. Mic, gain in the middle, low cut filter on, no EQ, hand center, turn those down. All right, so now that should feed in there. And now we just gotta find a place to plug it in. So, set it here for a moment. Power supply on top. This is gonna suck so bad. Spot to plug in? No, because all that shit's plugged in everywhere. Alright. So, where are you? Where do you go? You go there. Okay, we don't need that. Plug, please. Thank you. We'll stick that in there. And now it should be hot. Alright, so. Now it's hot, A1. Okay, set that right there. Now we gotta do the other side. So we're receiving. Now we gotta send it a signal. So here, saving the packaging for Denichi. Okay. This is really, really, really chintzy. Like it, you can tell it's the lowest, cheapest of the line of all of this stuff. Okay, so now we're gonna get a microphone for it. Lots of money, just warranty stuff. All right. If 
fuzzy bit goes over the thing. Okay, fuzzy bits on the thing. It's got a uh, cord clip here, but I don't know exactly where I'm going to want that yet. And that's a, you got to wear it for a while until it makes you crazy and then you know where to put the cord clip. So for now, I put my fuzzy thing on the wrong part. goes on the other part, it's a lot easier. Okay, now my fuzzy thing's on the right part. That was impressively done. Okay. Now, always have your mic plugged in before you turn your thing on. Flip it on. A, one, K. Set that up about halfway. K. So we should be whistling a signal. I don't just set in there for the moment. Audio check. Hey, we got audio here. We're showing audio. All right, so if I pull this down and pull this up, but hey, I got audio. Wow, it's good too. It's clear. It's nice. All right, so let's hide this mess back through here. Hand me that, please. Thank you. So we'll just set that in here, very shielded into the big metal box. Guarantee the worst possible signal. And if it works like this, we're just fine. Audio check, one, two, three. Hello, cameras along the line. Audio check. All right, so we've got a nice wireless audio set up, and I can go way over here, and it's aggravated as shit, but it still works. So, we've got audio. So this one works great. It won't fall out. It wants to be there. That's its happy place. And I put this one Thank you, Denichi. The new microphone setup is divine. Now I'm going to put this in this little box here. I'm just going to save that as my spare part. Now I'll put that in the cabinet. Cool. All right, you guys have fun. We'll be back. Today's Captain's Blog is brought to you by Frank Lawler, who holds the Guinness World Record for the number of consecutive days somebody has sent me a random link.